Recently, it was reported that BTS's Jungkook had gotten his own Spotify account. Initially, signs pointed in favor that the account was indeed Jungkook's as it was verified. Additionally, the artist's pick playlist was This Is BTS with a caption, requesting fans to wait for upcoming solo music. Since then, its verified sign has been removed. Now, this is starting debate on whether this account was fake the entire time. Even before the verified symbol was removed from the account, Army Kier, at Kirikowo on Twitter, was suspicious. So, she created a thread of all the signs that pointed to the Jungkook Spotify account being fake. Here's all the evidence. One, the Goffin.i in addition to adding a playlist, the artist added a fundraising pick. Upon looking further, Armies discovered that it is linked to a fundraiser on behalf of four-year-old Ariana Delling, who is suffering from a gunshot. Dot the Goffin was created two days ago by Ariana's and Dot while the BTS members are philanthropic, most donations are made privately. Additionally, they rarely ask of their fans, although most armies participate in donation campaigns themselves on behalf of the group. Still, none of the BTS members' official accounts have ever included this fundraising tag before. Dot this alone makes the Spotify account suspicious point too. You're unable to search in Cook. Dot well you can search other BTS members' Spotify accounts, Yin Cook fails to appear in the search for artists. Kira added, regardless of how little numbers the artist has, so long as it's genuinely official, it is searchable, they'll even give you related names. Dot point 3. The playlist stopped many armies who were loving the selected playlist by Jungkook. There was a lot to appreciate, from the playlist titles and covers to the featured songs. Global artists Troy Sivan, John Mayer, and Harry Styles were some of the few to have songs included in the playlists. While many wanted to believe that these playlists were simply a form of self-expression for Jungkook, questions were still raised. Not even the style of writing was unlike Jungkook. Dot not only that, but no other official solo account for a BTS member has included non-related playlists before. Also, when looking into the account behind the playlists, there's even more to evaluate. Most assumed it's Jungkook himself, but everything about it is weird. The profile picture choice has no relation to him. Dot additionally, the account has exactly 1000 followers exactly, and is following 29 people. These 29 followed accounts are the most unusual thing. You can't see all 29, but the ones you do include random names and profile pictures. A few BTS related accounts seem copied from the members Instagram accounts. And, like the other original account, they all have 1000 followers. Point 4. There's no proper information on the artist page to verify it is Jungkook.as you know, the Spotify artist page contains an about section. Jungkook's profile has had nothing but links for Wikipedia, Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. Out of all things, why these social media platforms and websites? At least, there should be a short bio like the other members. Not other than that, the coming soon is simply posted by anyone controlling the account. As Kira points out, this doesn't actually mean as much as most believe. Anyone can verify a Spotify account, as long as they go through a set of procedures. She added, I have a friend who has his own Spotify artist account, despite not being an official singer-songwriter. He does have one song there. Dot point 5. No BTS member, including, Jungkook has shared. All the members generally share big news related to themselves on social media, whether it's Webers, Twitter, or Instagram. So far, Jungkook nor the group's biggest supporter and hype man J-Hope has acknowledged the account. 
Riot Music has also said nothing so far.